Over the past 30 years, monarch numbers have been declining. The monarch butterfly is a step closer to extinction. It's now on the endangered list because of climate change, urban development, and pesticides in their food and habitat. And specialists say extreme temperatures are a major factor in their decline. If monarchs get wet from the snow, and then if the temperature drops, they're much more susceptible to freezing. So the last big die-off for monarchs was in the year 2016, when there was a big storm in Mexico that killed off, some people estimate, between 60 and 70 percent of the population. Andrea Serra is a butterfly ranger with the Butterfly Way Project, which creates natural habitats for butterflies with the David Suzuki Foundation. Monarchs aren't common in Vancouver, but there have been three reported sightings in the Okanagan recently, and she spotted one. I was like a little kid. So I ran and I followed it with my camera. I was like, please land, please. And it did, and I was able to capture it. And it definitely was a Western monarch, so that was really exciting. Community garden Gardens like this one have native plants that attract wild pollinators such as bees, bats and butterflies. These native plants provide shelter and food for pollinators. If you can try to add 50% of these plants to your garden, it gives a good mix so that the, the variety of bees and butterflies can find your garden. Mm -hmm. As a butterfly ranger, she helps maintain the garden at 29th and Bella Clava, which has Douglas Astor, Yarrow and Bee Balm, all native plants that attract pollinators and give butterflies food and shelter. Sarah says Vancouverites can also help revive the monarch butterfly population. If we don't have their food source, then they can't thrive here. So even if we have not personally seen mm -hmm. a Western monarch, we're encouraged to plant the milkweed because you just might see one, as we are seeing in the interior. Scientists say there has been a significant decline in milkweed because of corn and soya bean farms. Farmers change their weed control methods that milkweed disappeared. And because much of the breeding range of monarchs is used for farming, um, a lot of that habitat is just gone now. For more information on how to help protect monarch butterflies, check out the David Suzuki Foundation online. In Vancouver, Angela Bauer, City News.